Hey everybody, what's up? We are back on the Rare and to Go account with a little dust on top of the camera, baby. Um, <laughs> we've got a bit going on today and a lot to talk about. A couple ancient shards will probably pop. Got an artifact enhancement event going on right now, which is a decent opportunity for us to probably get another epic book and perhaps another copy of this rare. Um, and then I kind of started this yesterday. I kind of started talking about this yesterday where I said I was gonna like go ahead and use Outlaw Monk as a chicken. And um, and then maybe some of the epics as well. The more I've thought about it, the more I'm, I'm, I'm all the way in on like, Hykatoon's the only epic I'm gonna use. Everything else I'm gonna use is gonna be rare below. So there's really no reason for me to keep all these epics and legendaries that I keep pulling sitting in the vault because I'm not gonna use them and having them sitting in the vault will just be temptation for later to be like, okay, well now I've cleared stage 14 of this so I can, no, like, no, no. The point of this is to do everything we can do in the game with rares and high Katoon because high Katoon, right? So I think all these epics that I'm not gonna do anything with are food. I think I'm gonna use them as food. I could, I could get so many more champs built real quick. You know what I mean? If I had all these extra chickens, I think the only legendaries I won't feed are like uh, Ultimate Death Knight and Deliana because I can't remember if you can get her from shards now, but like, cause they're just unique. They were given to you in events, whatever. But these other Legos, like that's that's free five stars chickens. The, these login epics are, are four star chickens or five star chickens because they're almost maxed. You know what I mean? I, I want to do this with rares, and I don't want to get to a point where it's like, okay, well, I can't do this with rares, so I'm going to start bringing in more epics. No. We're getting rid of them. This is a rares account. This is High Katoon and the rares. So, we're using them as food, and that sucks. <laughs> I know that's going to suck to watch. Like, it's going to suck to watch me feed Geomancers. I'm ready to go! Had my, had my own guard down today. Um, what was I saying? Yeah. It's gonna suck to watch me use Geomancer as a chicken, but it's gonna happen. And there's no stopping me. <laughs> there's no stopping me. So yeah, I think, um, I think even the legendaries, like, we're doing it. That's, it's, it, that's, that, that's the challenge. That's the, it, it's a challenge account. Those champs are just taking up space, increasing my player power unnecessarily. So, uh, yeah, that's what we're going to do, all right? Um, which which means we can open up a bit. We can we can get a few more champs built at one instead of focusing one at a time now, right? I mean, we're already handicapped by, like, speed of progression and speed of farming and all this stuff. So to be able to have some more champs we can use is going to be pretty handy. And getting them out of the mix again will will get rid of any temptation I feel to use them. Like, you know what I mean? Broadmaw made Dragon 16 easier. And it was like, well, okay, but now, now I'm running two epics, you know what I mean? Uh, whereas now I've put in I put veteran in his spot, and they can do it. They're fine. You know what I mean? So most of the time they fail every now and then. But anyway, that's that's where we're at. That's what we're doing. That's the plan. So. There's no talking me out of it at this point. It's 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 a done deal. <laughs> it's the direction we are heading in. And we're gonna actually get some more champs rolling here so we can start doing some more things. So anyway, uh, how many gems do I have? I've got 2,600 gems. I'm gonna expand my roster a bit here. And get you out of there. And I guess y'all out of there too. And then I don't know what y'all are doing in there yet. I can chill there for a second. We also might need to go in and start doing our, um, the thing about doing the, the faction guardians right now is that like a lot of these champs still need skill ups and I don't want to deal with it just yet. So let's pop these two shards. Hopefully something interesting happens. And then, uh, Aethel. Do I have her already? Is Kale still the only starter I haven't pulled? Chicken. I'll take that chicken. Give me a coffin smasher, dude! 
what do I have to do? Get a coffin smasher around here. All right, I think I already had an able, which could be a good thing. Am I gonna build able? All right, there's a question. There's a question for the ages. Am I gonna build? I've got two of them. Okay. Yeah, I think I need to worry about getting champs built and skilled up before I start plugging them into faction guardian. Like if I pull a dupe Gallic or something, if I pull a dupe of someone I've already built, fine. Yeah, we'll start worrying about all that stuff later. All right, so we have quite a bit of food now. We can get quite a few champs rolling here. Uh, and then we've got a good bit of silver too, so we can progress pretty well in the artifact enhancement event. Let's get a look real quick. I need to make sure all the, all the epics are unlocked. Unlocked, unlocked. Like it sucks the books and stuff that I've put in them. It kind of sucks, but what are you gonna do? You know what I mean? It is what it is. All right, they're unlocked. Unlocked. Oh, I thought I did this already. Some good epics there, dude. All right, yeah, we should be looking pretty good. And if I'm not mistaken, I have made a ton of three-star chickens. Like, real quick, let's just take a look. I've got a few, but then uh, your, boy, your boy's been making food, dude. Um, so I can, I can get a few of these three-stars up and running, and then if we're talking about four-stars... We've got quite a few four-star chickens here now. You should be unlocked. Oh. Wow, I haven't done this in forever, dude. All right, let's put um, you in one. Will it let me drag? Yeah, okay. And you in one. We'll just leave it like that for now. And then what's my regular defense? I think it's just my cleave, yeah, okay. All right, let's take another peek there then. That covers them. Okay, so yeah, we've got quite a few four-star chickens here. And then for five-star, We've got uh, like so. There's one six star. There's we've got enough for two six stars without all the three and four star star stuff we need to do. And I need to go lock dagger. Where you at, chick? There you are. Get locked up. All right. So here's a question while we're at it. Is there a champ training thing going on right now? Oh my fucking god. The pop-ups have been relentless today, dude. Alright, champ training starts... Okay, so we'll hold off on that. But we are we are gonna... We are gonna put in some work during this champ training event, okay? Um... We are gonna put in some work on this champ training. That honestly, too, means I can start using legendary books as skill ups as well. Like, a lot of this stuff is just so ingrained, like, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it, that I feel like it's been holding us back. All of these are rare books now. All of these are rare books. Anything with a purple or gold border is a chicken now. And that's the way we're gonna do it, okay? So, tough decision to make. But we're going to do it, and we're going to stick with it, and that's going to be the way it is. So we're going to wait till this champ training event goes live, and then we're going to pop off a little bit. Let's think about... Let's think about who. Because we've got some options. Awesome. You know what? I need to look at, like, some of the champs that are four-star and three-star. Because I've got some great champs down here that I've been wanting to bring up. Honestly, Fireblade, I was going to do something with Clan Boss, but we're, we've... we've I think that ship has sailed. 
Also, I might have said something about like Dark Elaine being a four star chicken. She's not. She's gonna get taken to 40 and turned into a five star chicken. So if you if I said that, like ignore it. I'm not gonna be like super inefficient with the way I do it or anything. Uh, she'll probably get turned into a four star chicken as well. Um Who do we think we could bring up that's gonna do us some good down here? Someone said this dude was real good in Iron Twins. I think I saw a comment. A1 speed down. AoE. Increase accuracy on all allies. The defense down. The accuracy buff on all allies, I reckon, is pretty solid, huh? Alright, so who can we build? Greybeard. Revoke. AoE freeze on a three turn. AoE freeze on a three turn skilled up. First mark? Mark is pretty decent, actually. Okay, lock. When did that happen? Greybeard. I'm looking for Gnarl Horn. I thought I had a Gnarl Horn down. Yeah, there he is. What do you do? Damage increases according to how much HP this champion has lost. This attack cannot be strong, critical, or weak hit. Okay. Provoke on all enemies. It's a defense buff on himself. That's on a three turn. Places unkillable on himself for two turns. Okay. Okay. That, like I don't I, I don't know how much damage this does. I've never seen this in action, so I don't, I'm not real sure. You're the Fire Knight potential, right? Yes. Yeah, so we're not going to worry about you just yet. Headsman, fear, AOE heal reduction, more damage to targets under heal reduction. Okay. That AOE freeze on a three turn, skilled up is interesting for us. Kind of a low chance, 40% chance. A little low, but he's rare, so you know, what are you gonna do? We have a pain keeper. We could try to like, time that. I do wanna build something that can work on auto though. We have a renegade as well. You know what I need to do it too. Maybe I won't do this on camera, but I need to go through because, like, I know I've got a copy of her down there. I need to go through and, and add all of my skill ups into everyone that I have copies of the champs. You know what I'm saying? Um, that needs to happen. That that would clean up our roster quite a bit. Okay. All right. Okay. So I think what I'm gonna do today is I'm going to roll some gear, work my way through the artifact enhancement event a little bit. We're gonna take a look at our champs and then when the champ training event is live, maybe in tomorrow's video, I'll either I'll either get some champs rolling tonight so that tomorrow in the video we can try to do some stuff with them, depending on how my day goes, or tomorrow will be when we like, you know, get all the champs going, get some gear on them and, and do all that. Uh, it's, it's gonna depend on how busy I am today, honestly. But I think, I think, I feel good about the decision. It, it's a it's a it's a tough one. It's kind of like a rip the bandaid off. I think the idea of you know using Legos as chickens and stuff. But for the sake of what this account's supposed to be, 
that's what we're going to do. So um, we've got a lot of food. We're going to, I think we're going to make quite a jump in like, quite a bump in progress in the next couple of days. We're going to be able to get a lot of champs rolling. So uh, yeah, feel good about it. So that's it. I'm going to get out of here. Appreciate y'all. We'll see you tomorrow. Tomorrow's going to be a big day for us as well. We have a good one. Later.